um, we're going to be adding some great new features um, to the to the new site. Um, and it's all about you guys. It's all about getting you more exposure, finding new ways to get you in there, to get you seen, to get your work seen. Um, I was having a great conversation with Peter yesterday. Um, Peter asked a, a little bit of advice about his V Show card um, and just wondered how he can make it more effective and more useful. Now, obviously, on Spotlight, you've got your selection of headshots. Um, you know, they're all pretty ones. And, pouty or smiley or whatever, um, which is fantastic. Um, but V show cards, look, we can, we can target the roles we're going for. The, the, the V show card can have such a, a wonderful impact when you're applying for castings. So I spoke to Peter yesterday about his casting type because when, when you open up the V show card, it's got a picture of him looking mean. It's got a picture of him looking posh. There's a soldier picture, there's, there's a farmer picture. And there was very few. So I spoke to Peter and said, look, that's kind of what your spotlight is for, to give a general overview of yourself. So leave all the the the, the try you know the, the wide scope of images to your spotlights and things like that. But use your V show card to target roles you are going for. You'll be much more successful. Anyone who's seen my V show card will you know throw their hands up and say, look, do you know what? He's a fucking bad guy. He he, he does, uh, my my language. Um, but I, I do that on purpose, and I'm and it's very effective for me. I, I know what I look like, I know what I can do, I know my strengths, and I know I, I get the bad guy roles, the soldier roles, the gangster roles, the villain roles. So I target my V show cards for those roles. Um, people say, people do say, don't get typecast, don't allow yourself to be typecast. But at our early stage of our careers, it's important to be typecast because you're never going to be looked at. For every, I'm never going to be looked at for the hero role or the romantic role, am I? Let's be honest. So I'm, I'm not trying to be everything. I focus mine on the roles I know I can win. So my advice is be typecast. Work out what your type is. Work out what that ideal, what your strength is. Target your V show card for that role. So anyone's first impression when they open that V show card is, wow, like uh, Peter's one with his new updated photos and that you open it up and, and it's very aristocratic. It's very posh. It's the, the gentleman, the, the officer, the teacher, the, um, but you can, you can hit them with that first impression. Now, first impressions, as we know, are very, very important. Now, when a casting director opens your profile, if they're casting a soldier role and they open my role, uh, they open my V show card straight away. Their impression is that's him. That this is, this is the guy, this is what we're looking for. So work out what your typecast is, nail it, be the best at that. We can diversify later. Let's establish ourselves to get, get you know, 20 credits under your, un, under your belt for doing you know, the best roles you can do, your, your strength roles. And then again, we can diversify. I mean, I'm such a big idiot. I want to play all the kids villains and be such an idiot. But right now I know what roles I'm getting. Now at the moment I've, I've attended what, 31 auditions in person and I've won 25 of them jobs but that's because I'm target I know what my strength is so what I've done is I've worked on being the best in that typecast so when I was walking into an audition and there was 20 people who looked like me I still need to stand out somehow so you need to find a way of doing that so I realized that I'm, I'm getting the soldier roles the gangster roles so I, I really went to town on them I nailed them so when I go in I'm confident I bowl in there and my, my first impression that I want that CD to have a first impression so if I'm going for a gangster role I don't walk in there all smiley because I don't want them to think I'm a nice guy is my first impression I want them to think he's scary because then you're hitting them bang on the head and they're seeing their first impression of you is the character they're looking for so whatever your role is, target your V show card for that. Try and get some headshots that make you look like that. Spotlight, they, they will check out your spotlight. They can see all the other photos. You can, they can see your range. But on your V show card, target the roles you are going for. Your success rate will go from 3% to 30% by targeting exactly the roles you are going for. 